It took me a whole week just to do it, and I finally otherwise reached my goal. Or at least one of them, anyway. What's my other goal? Passing 999999 coins, basically having a million or more, if that's actually even possible. But does this cap at 999, or does it actually go even higher, where 9999 is the limit? Yep, there's only one way to find out. And by the way, these numbers here give a good idea on the overall distribution of the various items. And how frequent they generally are. However, minor enemies, of which I've also done stuff with, also contribute onto these middle rank ones here, like this one here, for example, this as well, and as long as that as well. But if you basically subtract this from that, you get the general idea. So it actually, rubies are actually more common, but because they get regular enemies included into the mix, well, it makes the sapphires just that wee little bit more common. Like before, look for that gold. That is not what I need. <laughs> Jeez. So what is the enemy spawning algorithm? The enemy must be off screen, or otherwise just simply not visible, for at least five seconds, and then a new enemy of that same type, usually the same type, will replace it, off in the distance, also out of sight. Although the lip part from the flashlights or whatever, that is not included. Of course, they could be provoked like that, no problem. Yep, there's one, there's two, actually. They don't take long. And of course, if you defeat one of them, then you got quite a bit of extra time just to wait. And what do you know? A little more progress. You have to wait one minute after you defeat an enemy, or smash a smashable, before it otherwise respawns. That barrel here, for example, if you come back a minute later, it'll be there. Unless, of course, it's been in the view for that long, but... Lear of the guard. Nothing on it. <laughs> Tease it again. More progress. And yeah, there, I found several bugs while doing all this. Did you see that just appear out of absolutely nowhere? And this one's even rich, too. What do you know? Saw another flashlight thing appearing out of nowhere. But to lure this one away, I'm gonna make it take a long detour. <laughs> it's a safer way to getting rid of it. Tease. And here's another case. Passing. Nine. 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 Of. A. Single. Item. Was. No. Easy. Feet. It. Took. An. Entire. Week. To. Do. This. Is. Only. But. A. Tiny. Bit. Of. What. Was. Needed. Studying the enemy spawning algorithm has greatly sped up the process and 
This is what I went through. There's another one. So, you might be wondering, how many of those things do I have? There's only one way to find out. Did, did I actually pass 999? No, ducks are supposed to be able to swim. Let's find out, can I have over 999 sapphires? And yes, you definitely can, even rubies, wow. So, oh my goodness, <laughs> I have easily 500,000 coins. First, I want to save. And by the way, story-wise, I just started episode 6. As soon as I got to episode 6, well, I stopped all the story progress because I found the map was very good. And the other ones went from there. This will take a ridiculously long amount of time. But just watch those coins going up. Too bad I don't have a turbo controller. Guts. This is just a handy trick, I know. I'm using two but fingers to press the same button at once. It's less predictable, but oh my goodness, it's a ton faster. All the medium nuggets are gone. Now I got the large gold bars. All the large gold bars are now gone. Now I got the topaz only dropped from those small enemies. And then the huge monster here. I thought this was the limit, but apparently not. All the sapphires are now finally gone, and all these monster rubies that really give a lot of money, or coins, I should say. We easily have over 120,000 coins worth on all these. With the rubies now finally almost gone, it's time for the lesser stuff. And finally, the very last item. Man, this really kind of wears out your hand, don't it? <sighs> Boy, that took a long time, but look how many coins they have. Oh my goodness, that's a huge amount. That is absolutely amazing as to how many coins I actually have. Just to grab some, you can actually see that very well. Yeah. Well, the next goal I have in mind is roughly double. And just in case you're wondering, well, let's. I want to get over there first. Why did the bear go like that? It's at the edge of visibility. 
That can be kind of fun to watch. This is basically what I need to do. That's it. It's the only bit I've done and I haven't even started it. In case you're wondering on the story progress that is.